Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Mark Sun and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing season 3, episode 34 of Seven Moon Crystal called Infinity 7 Transformation Super Sailor Moon. So we start off with um, when the chalice appeared or the grail appeared, they tend to switch up that term in this series. Anyway, when it appeared, it snapped them out of the whole fighting each other thing, and then the talisman started to glow, and then um, Sailor Moon does um, Moon Crisis power, and the brooches are now, so all the brooches on the Sailor Skeleton now went to a heart shape, and they kind of got upgrades, and now um, she upgraded to Super Sailor Moon, which was super cool, um, and then we got to where Fair and is very jealous, and so, um, <laughs> Super Sailor Moon got rid of the witches, and then we cut to Hotaru um, was uh, switched back to herself because she switched to someone else, then switched back. Then we cut to where Three Gardens are finally um, tells them what happened, and basically, if the Three Townsends glowed, it glowed to summon Sailor Saturn, who obliterated Silver Millennium because apparently. They messed up, and it was already kind of too late, where the Moon Princess went bye-bye, and the Queen also went bye-bye, so she just blittered everything. And, let's see, uh, you have to keep the three keys from touching, and it's Hokutaru, and they go in to offer. And she's already not far off from going away anyway, because of her injuries when she got burned so that's why she has the mechanical arms and legs because she got burned in a fire a long time ago and then we cut to Rosagi is very against it and and they knew that so that's why they don't want to work with her because of that and then we cut to Chibisa runs to go tell Hotaru and but Hotaru transforms to Mistress 90 and to Chibisa's brooch and I guess technically her soul, and ate it. And then Sarah Moon and Tetsu the Mask take her and escape, while also the other Sailor Guardian, the Uranus and Neptune saw that as well. So anyway, that was the end of the episode, and I didn't read it because it was kind of weird. Um, I gave it an A. It was a really good episode. You get to see a new transformation, which was super cool. I really enjoyed watching that. But the whole swallowing the Sailor Moon, the legendary Silver Crystal, that was crazy weird to me. But, um, and the way she just transformed into Mistress 90, I thought it was Mistress 9, but apparently it's Mistress 90, apparently. It wasn't, uh, I was right, it's Mistress 9. Where'd I get 90 from? I don't even understand. <sighs> so stupid, myself. Okay, let me fix that. Uh, hopefully I won't say that again in my next video. <laughs> but I thought it was a really good episode. I really enjoyed it. And that's one for this video. So like this video, please give it a like. Comment down below. Tell me what you think of the episode. Do you agree? Tell me, tell me your thoughts down below. <laughs> as well as any other shows you'd like for me to cover. And um, subscribe because it does help out the channel a lot. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye everybody. And I feel I'll be less awkward. <laughs> Doubt it. Bye.